lovely people you're welcome back to my channel once again i hope you're doing well and i believe you all are fine today we'll be talking about how to use uh, a hot fix applicator how to use it to apply our rhinestones crystal or stone as it may be called on our fabric so before we assemble it this is what we call a hot fix applicator as i earlier said it is used to apply stones on our clothes okay let's talk about the parts before we demonstrate how to use it it has a cord here for power supply before you use it you have to you need a power supply for it to be used properly then we have the power on and off button when you on here it on and when you off, touch here down it off also we have the power indicator which is this red light here once it's on you see the light on to red then we have the handle this is where we call the handle where you hold and apply it to your fabric then we have the applicator the applicator pen which is this tip here this is the applicator pen and we have the stand while using and it is hot you have the stand you place it on your stand here you place it on the stand so that it doesn't burn your fabric also the Hot fix applicator have seven heads ranging from two millimeter to nine millimeter depending on so the sizes are engraved on the the tip of the applicator if you look closely on the side of the uh, tip you will see the sizes so this is two millimeter just like that until you get to nine millimeter here is our stone that we'll be using for today's demonstration. So let's power the hotfix applicator and test it. Okay. I've put it on power. So this is how you on it. As you can see, the power indicator is indicating that it is on also the applicate the tip it has a groove or a, a point that has ridges where you can screw it to the applicator all right and see what i'm doing that is how you screw it to the applicator then if you want to remove it from the applicator you also do the same thing but don't do it with your bare hands Either you use a plier or you use a piece of cloth to remove it. A thick piece of cloth because it's very hot. So let's remove this one. And let's apply. Let's demonstrate how we apply uh, the heat on the stone. So before you apply your stone, you, if it is a drawing, you want to apply it on. You must have done your drawn out your drawing on, on your fabric but for today's tutorial we are not drawing out any pattern on this fabric so we just want to demonstrate how to apply it on our fabric so you place your stone on your fabric pick the appropriate tip this is four millimeter you pick the appropriate tip apply it to your hot face applicator put it at the tip at the applicator pen then you power it you keep it for like 10 to 20 seconds for it to be hot so our hot fix applicator is ready for use now we've left it for about 10 to 15 seconds and make sure you use the appropriate tip so that you can be able to uh, glue firmly on the fabric so 
let's apply this on our fabric okay as you can see it's firm so you leave it for about 20 seconds so that I can firmly glue on your fabric if you fix it immediately and start pulling it it might pull off ah, it's very hot so you have to be careful why applying this hot fix applicator on your fabric because it's very very hot also keep out of reach of children okay as you can see sorry as you can see it's firm on my fabric very hot very very hot so this is how to apply stones on our fabric using the hot fix applicator so also depending on the size of your stone like this is a smaller size this is two millimeter we have it here you just all you do is to change the tip of this uh, one you change this tip and fix in the two millimeter tip and you place your stone on your fabric and also apply the heat on your stone for it to glue on the fabric thank you very much for staying till the end of this tutorial if this tutorial has been very much helpful to you you can give me a thumbs up please don't forget to subscribe click on the subscription button and touch the notification bell to always get notified anytime i upload my videos and share and like my videos thanks for watching till the end see you in my next tutorial bye bye